is a Talabardine chapel near Ochterada in Perth and Kinross. It was constructed as a simple rectangular building in 1446 for Sir David Murray of the nearby Talabardine castle. It's thought it was originally intended to be a collegiate church, which was a form of private chapel where priests would continually say prayers for the souls of the Murray family. However, Sir David died shortly after it was completed, and this never came to pass. In the year 1500, Sir Andrew Murray, the son of Sir David Murray, added a transept to the church on the north side and the south side. This gave the church a cross shape. It was last used for public worship in around 1715. However, it was the family mausoleum, and Murrays were buried here up until around the 1900s. Talabardine Castle was once an important and substantial fortification. It was visited by royalty on occasions such as James VI. It was demolished totally in 1833, and the stone was used in constructing nearby farms and other buildings. The rather short tower with its external niche for a statue was also constructed by Sir Andrew Murray in 1500. The chapel is remarkable in that it has very little alteration since 1500. It still has its original roof. It went through the Reformation with very few changes. Indeed, there are several niches for statues. The other statues are long, no longer there. The niches have been left. Inside the building, you also find a number of mason's marks. Up until at least 1570, a highly unusual garden feature lay in between the chapel and Talibardine Castle. And this was the outline of the ship, the Great Michael, planted in Hawthorne. The Great Michael was named after the Archangel Michael and was one of the ships of the Royal Scottish Navy constructed by James IV. It was very large, it had twice the displacement of the Mary Rose and had to be built in New Haven because nowhere in Scotland could do so. It's said that much of the woodland in Fife um, was removed for its construction. James IV had built the Great Michael with the intention of using it in a crusade by the Scots against the Ottoman Empire. However, they, this did not come to pass, and James IV was killed at the Battle of Flodden. The ship was very expensive to maintain. Eventually, it was sold to the French Navy. The chapel now stands in a very rural and isolated spot. There's a small farm nearby. The entrance to the cemetery is just off the small path, whilst around the corner of the north transept is the entrance for visitors. On either side of the entrance there are the coat of arms of the Murray family. <laughs> 